We have reached the final category, so let us go through once more the shortlist for the Trillium Book Award in English, the English language category, also a prize with a $20,000 check attached. Wonderful honor to honor these incredible books. Enfin, nous avons les finalistes dans la catégorie du prix littéraire Trillium en langue anglaise. Il y en a six. Margaret Atwood for Stone Mattress, McClelland and Stewart. Uh, I started writing it on a boat in the Arctic and it's about how you might murder somebody on a boat in the Arctic. I'm sure it's something that occurs to people on boats quite frequently. So how to murder somebody and get away with it. So in fact, it was Graham Gibson who had it all, all figured out how you would do it. But then of course, you have to put some characters in it who are actually fulfilling uh, those kinds of stipulations. Dion Brand for Love Enough, Knopf Canada. It is a, a meditation on contemporary life in the city and the um, possibilities for defining uh, love expansive enough to contain the individual, the social and the political. So that's, that's kind of briefly the thesis of the book, but of course it involves uh, three interacting characters or interpolative characters. Kate Cayley for How You Were Born, Peddler Press. Strangeness, I thought I wanted to get it, the strangeness of a perfectly ordinary life um, that might be in a crisis, or, but it also might not be, or it might be in a crisis that's very imperceptible. Uh, and then I wanted, I the, the beautiful thing about a short story collection is that you can find very high contrast. Like when I was trying to select the stories, I felt like I was selecting and very much with editorial help, what would, um, that the stories would complement each other. James King for Old Masters, Cormorant Books. I myself believe that uh, nonfiction is always a form of fiction, and I've always, and I've come to believe that uh, biography is a form of fiction. And, uh, but my protagonist, Guy, he doesn't uh, really uh, believe that. He believes um, basically that certain truths can be known or not known. And in the course of the book, he learns that maybe that's not true. Thomas King for The Back of the Turtle, HarperCollins Publishers. Uh, I really was more concerned about the creation and maintenance of community. So uh, as I go through the book, I'm trying to juxtapose uh, certain ideas about community, uh, communities of one, which Dorian certainly is uh, my character in Toronto, as opposed to the community of a uh, number of people as that small community at Samaritan Bay is. And Edmund Meditawaban with Alexandra Shimo for Up Ghost River, Kanaf, Canada. And I put my own experiences in there just to indicate that this is the truth. And uh, what's in there is, uh, is what happened to, to me and to all of us. We shared all those things. We shared the strap, the electric chair, the vomit, and uh, the beating up. Those are your finalists for the Trillium Book Award 2015. Over to the minister for the name of the winner. And it's with great pleasure that I announce the winner of the Trillium Book Award, Kate Cayley, for How You Were Born, published by Peddler Press. You can start to make your way up here, Kate. I'm going to share the words of the jury as you do, as the applause continues. 
How You Were Born, says the jury, is a riveting debut story collection that continually surprises with its effortless blend of the psychological, the domestic, and the surreal. Whether she's exploring the lives of circus performers, over-imaginative children, or an elderly man convinced that his next-door neighbor is his doppelganger, Kate Gailey teases out unexpected insights, connections, dark secrets, and moments of transcendence. Ladies and gentlemen, Kate Cayley and Beth Follett from Peddler Press. a speech. Um, when the finalists were announced and I was beside myself, um, we were trying to explain to our seven-year-old what we were so excited about. And my partner said, well, Mama is on a short list with some of the best writers. We had to explain what a short list was. Um, with, with some of the best writers in Canada. And our daughter, without missing a beat, said, well, you're not going to win. Um, <laughs> so my first thank you is to the other finalists. Uh, the books you imagined, the books you endured, um, and I am so, uh, I am awed to be in your company. Thank you very, very much. Um, thank you to, uh, to Beth Follett and Elena Muntz. Uh, Beth is the publisher of Peddler Press, and both of them alternated as my editors. I'm so grateful I have become a better writer through you. I can't believe I'm up here. Um, <laughs> Thank you to everyone associated with the Trillium Prize. Thank you to the jurors, uh, to Janet for all your help. Um, to my partner, Leah, who is here with our youngest. Um, I would be a ridiculous person without you. And uh, I, I just, I'm overwhelmed. And when you write, you write alone. You think through it alone. You struggle with it alone. And then occasionally you get the feeling that you aren't and that you're, you're utterly surrounded. So I'm so happy. Thank you very, very much to all of you. Is this not the best evening of the year, honestly? I hope you invite me back next year, Karen. It's so incredible. Quelle soirée extraordinaire. Je tiens une nouvelle fois à féliciter tous les lauréats et finalistes. Would you join me in, in congratulating? I know we've been very effusive, but for good reason. Breck and Michelin, Michelle and Kate, and our finalists one more time. Thank you so much. Just a couple of comments in conclusion. We were watching those wonderful video snippets, the extracts of interviews, and I want to remind you that you can see last evening's festivities. If you missed the reading, you can see those interviews from the shortlisted authors, and you can see tonight's as well online. They're going to be posted shortly on OMDC's YouTube channel, which is OMDC Online. Uh, and with that, I can tell you that uh, la partie officielle de la cérémonie a désormais pris fin. Je vais demander à tous les de bien vouloir se rendre sur la scène ici dès la fin des discours pour que nous puissions vous prendre en photo. Dans l'intervalle, nous invitons le reste de nos invités à aller se servir des desserts et du café à l'arrière du pièce. Je vous remercie de votre présence ici parmi nous ce soir. Thank you so much for being here tonight as we've celebrated the 28th annual Trillium Book Award. What a special evening as always. It's a beautiful annual tradition.